Hello, I'm Dana. I want to speak to you about the life crisis we're facing in Ireland today. Sadly, our Irish government is on course to introduce an abortion regime that would, as one of our bishops put it, lead to abortion on demand. They intend to do this in spite of the fact that the people of Ireland have consistently voted against abortion and referenda, and also that our country is acknowledged as a worldwide leader in safe medical care for mother and child. In Great Britain, the 1967 Abortion Act was passed under the guise of exceptional cases. But 45 years later, there have been 7 million abortions performed in Great Britain to date. That's around 600 babies deliberately killed every day. That's one tragedy you won't see in the news headlines. But here in the Republic of Ireland, we know of not even one single case where legal surgical abortion has taken place. Pope John Paul II said, a country that kills its children is a country without hope. You know, Ireland's famed for its love of family and children. We know the deliberate killing of even one child can never be justified, and we cannot allow this to happen in our country. We must stand together like never before against those who would deny the overwhelming and clear wishes of the majority of Irish people enshrined in our constitution. That from the moment of conception, life must be protected. We need to storm heaven right now. Will you join us, please? Go to the EWTN Ireland website and pray with us that our country will remain a safe place for unborn children and their mothers. To join in prayer and to find out how you can help the pro-life movement in Ireland, go to EWTN in Ireland at EWTN.ie.